Farmers are killing their mink by gassing them with carbon monoxide one by one. After the family at this farm fell ill with COVID-19, it became clear other people didn't infect them. The genetic structure of the virus they contracted was similar to mink infections. Every year, thousands of young mink are killed and their fur is exported to China, Russia or the United States to be made into coats and fashion accessories. The Dutch government initially said it wasn't necessary to cull the mink, but changed when it became clear infections were widespread. A last-minute court case filed by animal rights activists failed to save the animals. They will have to kill the mothers, the pride of their companies. Nobody wants to do that, and their newborns, only four to five weeks old. That is, of course, heartbreaking. The Netherlands is the first country where COVID-19 has been found in mink farms. And researchers are urging other countries, such as Denmark and Spain, to test their animals as well. There is a fear that uh, the, the mink farms could be a reservoir in future. The outbreak in the Netherlands is now uh, decreasing, is fading out in humans. So we don't want to have a reservoir in mink farms because there will be a continuing risk. Four million mink are caged in 145 Dutch farms. Researchers don't rule out that most will have to be culled. Nearly 10,000 mink are being killed here at this farm today, and this is only one of the smaller ones. Animal rights groups have long protested against mink farming, and the government has decided that they all need to be closed by 2024. But some farmers have said that despite the risks of new infections, they want to continue their business until then. Animal rights groups say the farms should be closed immediately. After rumors spread that activists wanted to free the mink, police started to patrol the area, questioning them and journalists. There's a lot of talk about um, the danger of anim animal agriculture to the public health. Um, the corona crisis among the mink is just one of them. Um, so there is a lot of tension among the farmers. They feel threatened in their livelihood. And that makes some people uh, aggressive and, and that's why there's a lot of police always when there's animal activists. The farms are located in the southern Netherlands, which has the highest number of COVID-19 deaths in the country. Residents of Gemert Bakel, known as the Dutch mink capital, blame the government for acting too late. They had urged the killing of mink as soon as they became sick a month ago. Stepfasen, Al Jazeera, in the southern Netherlands.